I don't know, man. Hopefully, hopefully, y'all can get it together. Yeah, what else we got? Man, I want to go ahead and get straight into it, though. Let's get into the motherfucking elephant in the room. There's an elephant in the room. Big ass elephant in the room. Motherfucking Pusha T. Jim Jones. Do, 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 do. This shit going. Do, 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 do. You looking at me for my opinion? <laughs> I mean, nigga, we, it was a dramatic pause. Dude. <laughs> nah, I mean, I. What do you think of Jim? A lot of people saying they hope this shit don't get out of hand, and I'm looking at who the two people is. Yeah, yeah, old ass niggas, they're not getting, they're not getting out of hand. He's old. I ain't gonna front. I, I love Pusha. I fuck with Pusha heavy, but Pusha definitely. Says shit that makes you want to make shit get out of hand, bro. That's, that's a fact. <laughs> that's a fact. It might get out of hand. Because <laughs> Pusha know how to just say shit that just, that shit sting. And Jim is still an idiot. Like, not a, he's, he's just retarded. He's yeah, emotional. He, he, yeah. So, it might. And he always rolling with like 50 niggas. Mm-hmm. So, I mean, hopefully this shit stay music, though. I don't want this shit to go no further than music. If, um, if it stay music, though, I... What was the name of Pusha T's uh, first subliminal shit? Did he even have a name? Here. I'm going to, um, actually, I'm going to, we could play little snippets of both. That's why I love this new YouTube feature. You just cut the music out. Keep my monetization. And get it. I know by now you get the message. Uncle said, nigga, you must be sick. I think I went too early. Now I'll come with your necklace. I buy bitches, you buy infections. Hold on. Hold on. Dumb, dumb. <laughs> nigga, nigga did this on the runway in Paris. Crazy. At Louis Vuitton fashion show. <laughs> he was talking. <laughs> nah, he he talking on this shit. <laughs> Snow tombstones in the desert. It's not. Oh, you know how many quotables is in that in that one minute verse? That was different. <clears throat> I buy bitches, you buy them sections. You buy watches, I buy, I buy collections. That's a bar. Jim came back, though. Yeah, and it wasn't bad. People, Of course, everybody here at hometown made it seem like Jim, yeah. this wasn't. I mean, and it wasn't, you know, he's not going to beat Pusha lyrically. Nah, but he. He going to fight, though. He going to talk his shit. Yeah, he ain't going to just be pushed around. Shit, I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> On the same beat, so I, I, like I like that. I like that energy. But listen here, before you, before you drop that, well, before you drop this shit, let me you laughing, huh? That shit was trash, we gonna let them get a do over. They got you gas, you must think that you the new over. You a 4 that old nigga, I jumped in a new rover. Your brother still jumping in bed, and you tell him move over. That's crazy, though. Niggas don't know what to do in no way. Call you ain't get you whiffed, but that's what they do to the slaves. Mm. I'm stealing on a nigga, you tell me some shit rage. like that. Really have bombs on the block, just like I threw a grenade. You need. Don't got no time to be concerned with no watch you got. You never been uptown, by now work up by the poppy spot. Trying to get illusions when you run up in the hockey spot. My 5,000 bottles, you turn around and get a choppy chop. I 
spent five hundred thousand down in Mazda spot. I got a half a million car with the bras on top. And fuck their flowers, we got roses with the stars on top. I make a toast with my jewels like the Mazda top. My name is my name, but they ain't screaming yet. They talking about the rapper came, but we ain't seen it yet. We got the switches on that bitches, your whole team get wet. Mm -hmm. Let me chill, cause I don't wanna get my team upset. The yeah. only beef you know, nigga, it's Arby's or the Big Mac. You know, drop, the only you know, beef you know is Arby's or the Big Mac. The last shit you dropped, that shit was garbage. Take that shit back. Plus you got your Going at your endorsement. <laughs> talking about your brother, what happened to that boy? Mm. It's looking like it, they be selling crap to, to that boy. Mm. It's really though, enough of the jokes, it's how niggas get embarrassed. Uh -huh. Really got some money, I catch you niggas, niggas out in Paris. Paris. Uh. Shooters like Luca, they hit you niggas out in Dallas. Y'all be dressing kind of weird, man, you really need a status. Plus, we all know what you identify with. Plus, you kind of sort of dress, nigga, you been what a fly, fly bitch. bitch. And then he said that I was really chasing a feature. Really? Niggas a gorilla, cause he got some apes in his features. All my gorillas got stones, I had these apes come and meet you. Put these billies on a jet, you pick a place there. Meet you, nah, nigga. Train, nigga. And talk about my jewels, that was a cheap shot. Yeah, and these is all VVS, these ain't the cheap rocks. Mm -mm. I don't know if you're a rapper, I said treat you like a street I ops. I know the top 50 list, I was a mm. I could imagine what you're going through. <laughs> yeah. He talked his shit back. He, he, he defended himself, he fought back. And like, he so, had some good punches in there too. Yeah, nah, for sure. The, the only, only beef you know is the Arby's or the Big Mac. Like, you lost one endorsement. Now you got them. That's he talked this shit to that man. No. <laughs> Yo, but the only thing is, like, is it one on one or does Malice get involved? Because he mentioned them, but so now it's like, nah, I don't think so. I don't think Malice get involved. Cam put up a message too the other day, like, I'm not jumping in y'all nigga shit. Yeah, just don't say my name. Just don't use me. Man. Leave me out <laughs> that shit. Cause Pusha dropped the or somebody dropped the clip. I don't know. Pusha dropped it. Somebody dropped the clip of where Cam was saying Jim is an emotional nigga. Yeah, and it wasn't him being. He wasn't dissing him. He was just talking yeah. about his friend. Like my nigga's emotional. I know my yeah. homeboy. Like he cried. Yeah. That's what he do. And I I need niggas to understand. Emotional don't always mean pussy. like soft. Yeah, you're not soft, pussy. It just means you got emotion, nigga. You show that. Because niggas catch bodies off emotion. Most of the killers <laughs> I know are emotional niggas. Dead ass. Like, Most of the killers I know are emotional niggas. They. They going crazy now, and they go think about whatever repercussions later. Like, mm -hmm. so yeah, that don't that don't mean so. They just they be filled with emotion. Some niggas don't display that shit. Some niggas display that shit. I know Pusha cooking up though. I know it got to be because it wasn't a bad it wasn't a bad comeback. It's not yeah. one that you could just brush off and be like, oh, I'm not gonna respond to that shit. Yeah, nah. You gotta respond to that because you can't be like, now nah, that shit was ass. I ain't responding because you started it. Yeah, you started on wax, but. I know Pusha though. Pusha, oh, it's gonna be he, some shit. he set that up. Yeah, it's gonna be some shit. Yeah, yeah. to do that so he can do that. He fell into a trap. I'm quite sure that man fell into a trap. And right now, I know Jones probably, he probably kicking back right now, chilling. He probably cooking up too a little Pusha bit. Ain't, though. Pusha ain't responded in a little bit, so he probably trying to figure out what the fuck going on. Mm -hmm. I think Pusha gonna drop July fourth. Just yeah. on some. <laughs> that would be it. On some wild random shit. Independence Day fireworks type shit. <laughs> Yuck. I ain't mad at it. Nah, man. It's going It's. I like this shit. Jada said he don't like it. Why? He said he. Buster said he don't like this shit either. He said he tired of. He said he tired of beef. Like niggas beefing and shit. I mean, if it ain't real beef, if it's just rap shit. Y'all just yeah. talking shit back and forth. It's cool. We don't, we don't really need nobody really beefing in the streets. Yeah. Especially being the fact that both of them niggas is over 40. Yeah, like, <laughs> bro, you're over fucking like. I don't want to hear shit about you still being active, nigga. Yeah, you got that. why, bro? You're a millionaire. You're forty. It's not like you just became a millionaire. Y'all been millionaires. You should not be active in no kind of real shit. Yeah, <laughs> that's why even when they beat Freddie Gibbs up, I'm like, yo, why? Nah, Freddie Gibbs might deserve to be beat up. <laughs> <laughs> So I can that understand why the Buffalo niggas did it. Oh yeah, that's what I was talking about. Yeah, nah, but remember, uh, Jones and them beat him up in the uh, in the restaurant oh, that's in right. Florida. Give that shit Doobie was getting, so random. I'm like, yo. He was Doobie getting beat up a lot. Maybe that's just Freddie Gibbs, though. <laughs> but, I mean, to his defense, though, like, every situation that he got beat up, like, it's, it's been mad niggas it beating him up. It has been mad up, niggas on him. <laughs> like, I haven't seen, like, him get beat one up one-on-one on one one. yet. Yeah, it's so definitely, it's, it's always, yeah. That's, that's a it's fact. It's always mad niggas whooping on him. Definitely got to put that out there. <laughs> I mean, so. you stand tall and fight. You stand tall and fight. Hell yeah.